Hey everyone, in this video, I'm just gonna show you some of the common stops you can do when you're rollerblading with your dog. So I'm on a hill here, and the first stop I recommend is the classic grinding your wheels. Personally, I would highly recommend taking off your brake whenever you rollerblade with your dog, since you're not able to go around backwards at all, and turning backwards is one of my favorite ways to stop like this. It's a very effective way to stop and it allows you to have a lot more variability when you're out on the road. It seems challenging but it's actually quite easy when you hold on to the leash. It's super slippery. Because <laughs> let's face it, dogs don't know the rules of the road and they might end up challenging you from time to time. If you need to stop even more, you're able to jolt on the ground even more with the leg that's further backwards. It definitely does take some practice but if you're more of a beginner with inline skating, I highly recommend checking out this video. I'll put it up on the screen right now and I'll also leave it at the end of this video as a little end screen for you. But yeah, essentially the two ways I recommend you stop is by dragging your wheels and by doing little 360 circles while also holding onto the leash. Holding onto the leash allows you to shift your momentum easily while holding onto something similar to like holding onto a rail. Holding onto the leash as you do these is super, super helpful. I highly recommend you check out this how to roll a blade with your dog video. I put a ton of time into this and I think it will really help you. But yeah, definitely give this video a like if it helped you out and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. If you still have questions, feel free to ask away and I'll do my best to answer you. Thanks for watching everyone. Cheers.